you would share with our people about your experience in Hungary, about the family as the cornerstone unit? So uh, the most important thing that those who are fighting for the family values yeah. must believe more than 100% that they are right. Mm. If you don't believe that you are more than 100% right on that, mm -hmm. so many attacks will arrive to you that you can retreat. You'll waver. So, uh, so if, if you would like to do it seriously, you must be devoted 100% to that. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and you must believe at the same time that even those people who have no voice in public politics, they are with you. Because mm. the far the majority of the societies are pro-family. Love that. Even, even if they are not able to express in an eloquent way, but they are pro-family. Even if they're not pro-Republican, they're still pro-family. Right? Absolutely. It's not about party politics. Yeah. It's, it's a question of heart. And you see that to be true in Hungary that, as well? That, that, that's why it's working in Hungary. Yeah. So it's working. That, that's the reason why it was supported overwhelmingly of the population to write into the constitution that the father is a man, the mother is a woman. Mm -hmm. We don't have same-sex marriage and all that kind of things. So we defend at the, by the constitution uh, all the values belonging to the families. And, 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 the, and the public is very much supported because, because they are born conservative. Mm -hmm. Regardless they are Republicans or, uh, or Democrats, on family issues, each human being is a born conservative. Mm -hmm. That's my point. Beautiful. Well, I think that point about conviction, I think, is powerful. Thank you. Good to see you.